China press journalist Ong Siu Chin conducted a webinar entitled News Reporting in Times of Pandemic to benefit the Utah Broadcasting students via Microsoft Teams this afternoon. She pointed out, before the pandemic, there was almost no restriction to cover assignments related to government departments, political parties, politicians, officials, court trial and parliament sessions. In contrast, most journalists work from home nowadays, leading to lesser chances in covering other assignments held in a hotel or a government department. In the sharing section, she mentioned the main challenge in this period is the new norm set by the government, where only official media only OMO and selected invited media are allowed to attend the press conference. According to Ng, this has implied the difficulty for the journalists to access to the pandemic updates and further information, causing the press freedom to be affected. If you are not inviting all media and you are not uh, having Zoom sessions but you just FB live, it's a one-sided communication, you know, just disseminate the info that you want to reach out to the public but you don't want to accept questions, accept, uh, you don't want to, us to uh, asking you questions or, you know, even like a bit confronting you on some of the problems. It's a bit of unfair to us uh, as journalists. Apart from studying the cluster data and case data of COVID-19 pandemic, journalists have to keep up with different versions of SOP that change from time to time. To ensure everyone's safety, Ng described the biggest changes in attending conference. Uh, they can only stay in the media room, la, if I'm not wrong. Okay? They can no longer go to the corridor, to draw law, no, no, no more this. La. And also they have to do swap tests la, before attending the special meeting, before going into parliament. They have to do swap tests three days before la, and bring the result to prove they are negative. La. When mentioned the role of media in curbing COVID-19 pandemic, Ng claimed that media plays a very important role in raising public awareness by asking pertinent questions that will lead to some changes or impacts. Tam Xiaoying reporting for Utah from Sungai Long.